I have not played the new Elise. I could try new Elise or I could play Cabs. I'll let you guys decide. One or two. What would you like to see? Okay, yes, that is clear. I don't know what the, the plan is. We'll make up our plan along the way. As I do most things in life. I just make shit up. What does that mean? I think it, it means we take the role here. Scabs is toxic. Scabs is boring. Scabs has scabs. Okay. <laughs> That's enough reasons for me. Sure. Does it pick Shadowwalk? There's no way you took Shadowwalk. Come on. Fishu. Also really highly rated player. Deep sub off. Okay. It's going to be a stacked lobby again. For Finley. I mean, probably. This is one of the best players in the world. He won the very first Lobby Legends. So, pretty sure he can pull it off. No Naga, no Pirate either. Wait, what? There's no better cries. There's no tokens. What are you doing? I don't know what he's gonna do. I guess we'll find out. Okay, that is pretty disgusting. We're gonna just power leveling to tier 3 here. He level as well, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna lose because he has Salamental. Probably, I guess. We also got a Brucon. Yeah, that we just faced. I don't know. That hero is so bad as well. And Toki? And Oz Dude, this lobby is so scuffed. <laughs> this lobby has so many bad heroes. And then we have Galakon that can high roll. Varden that can high roll. And Togwaggle that is just the best hero in the game. And then me. Good old Elise. Trying to figure out what the hell I'm doing with my life. And we'll figure out soon. I don't know. I think I use the hero power um, at least on tier 4. Because you could go 4-4. Four four. Oh, that is a really good shop. Let's go. Didn't even need my free roll. I am happy. As long as I get to attack first or they don't kill this right away, I'm happy. We can go so many ways here. I'd love to go Menagerie. I have not played a Gem Spitter comp in a while. Also not an Agam comp in a while. I want to play Spitter Agam. Please. Also, very important announcement. Guys. Hydrates. Don't forget to drink water. It's, it's hot out there. You need water to function. Your body is going to shut down. Take my advice. Dude, my, my shops are nutty. Holy shit. Yeah, that was a very shitty fight, but I'm, uh, I'm fine with uh, <laughs> getting gems here. Ooh! I mean, it's either this or roll again. Maybe I was also a reset. Mm. I don't really want more quill bores, actually. It's either Mummy or Roll. I think I'm gonna Roll. Call me crazy. Ho! Oh! See, and that is the difference between you and me, chat. Wasn't Self as good? No, Self is not a good card. Like, it could shield something and give me another gem, but I'd rather just roll a better card, you know, than a 2-drop. Hoo hoo hoo! Okay, where does this gem go? I think here. If it's streamer luck, no, that is called skill. <laughs> Definitely. Just look look at this. Look at how magnifique of a board is this for turn 5. I haven't pressed hero power yet. I think I'm just going to 5 and pressing hero power there and hoping I hit um, Agam. And I think my gold works out really well, actually. No, I'm not freezing for that. That's not good. I think it's an interesting idea, but... No! But yeah, I think this curve works really well on one of these, I just realized. Because next turn we can just level buy, and the turn after we can level button. So that's actually pretty sick. Okay. Lots of options. We always level. It's either Taunt to guarantee, it's Sensei to buff, or it's this to buff. These are basically the same cards, but I think it's Sensei because I can module this. Otherwise I have no module target. And I can menace this. Yeah. I could consider holding my gems in case we had Agam next turn. Um, but yeah, next turn I can just level button. So see, this curve actually works really well. If you power level on Elise, you skip tier 4 essentially. Which is usually a weird thing because tier 4 is good. But again, you can also do a farm curve. You can do different kinds. There, there's so many ways you can play this, I think. This just feels natural right now. I hope I don't lose. Not committing jam could... It actually hurts here. Oh no, it doesn't. Okay. It doesn't. Let's go. Don't hit my deflecto. Nice, we have a chance now. Okay, that was a bad hit, never mind. That was close. I'll take it. Ooh, that's a good card. But it's not gonna be as good as Agam. Haha! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that is the power of... Of... 
being built different. <laughs> That's why I held gems. I held two gems just for this to happen. And I got rewarded. Oh, this feels good. This feels good, man. This curve with the least felt nice, even though I lost a lot of health. I'm gonna get another 5 drop next turn. I could level and take a 6 as well. I can level sell hero power, get the 6 drop quill bore. But I think that's too greedy. I'll just take another 5. And then the turn after I could level but and take a 6. I have freeze for elemental buff? I don't know. It's plus 5 plus 5. But I think what I'd rather hit is another good tribe, which would be... Murloc. Probably 7. This is another tribe as well, but I don't know. Uh, this triple would be good. Demon Battle Master would be alright. But... Yeah, I don't think I'm freezing. Okay, going first is good. We got their gem splitter, get wrecked. It's a gem splitter diff. Nice, I got four gems, which is all I really care about, honestly. Mojo would also still be a good hit. Um, seems like I'm winning this. God bless. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Hmm. Lilreg is also an elemental, but Gurgle. Okay, these all suck. I'll just take this for now. This is actually a good taunt. Mm, but I'm running into board space issues then. Okay, I'll take Jug, I guess. Win this game. Thumbs up. Thank you, man. Necro. Maybe I should have actually leveled. Maybe I'm too scared. I'll just play this and chill. I'm not going to care about the Murloc too much. I find Cookie, I can use this. I'm not going to use it without Cookie. No, oh, okay, I didn't die. Wait, is Joker to snipe my shield? It's kind of bad. Do I lose now? I might. They also have Agam Spoiler, but they're actually weaker than us. Imagine the Tog being weaker than the Elise. I'm so happy I get to play Aga Menagerie with gem splitters. It's been so long. And we're now dealing 15 to the Tog, who is a monster. Alright, we're leveling and this ear powering. Uh, no, I was thinking of the buy war gear, but I don't think it's worth it, because I don't want to freeze the shop. I don't want to freeze because there's a lot of cards I still want, and that makes sense. So I'll just level here. Button. Hallelujah! Call me a god gamer. I could also play Greasebot. But I think I prefer the Dark Gaze Elder. Maybe just sell the Sensei next turn. Yeah. That is why I'm, I went with this line. <laughs> maybe I, yeah, maybe I should have leveled last turn. The reason I want to stay down is because I'm a bit scared. And again, there's a lot of good cards to hit, but hey. If you just get good, you make sure I don't lose to whatever the hell Brukan is doing. The cookie would be good, obviously. I mean, the longer I wait, the better cookie gets as well. If I get cookie next turn, it's like, what, plus 20, plus 20, something? If I could get it turns later, it's just gonna get more and more stats. Um, but I still... I only have two shields right now. And my menagerie is only three tribes, but that's fine. I'm not gonna focus too much on getting four or five tribes or getting more shields, because that way you actually get weaker. You just need to play the board that you have. I could play Boomba though. If I triple splitter, I could sell Sensei, play Boomba, and I still have a flex spot, and I could be my board. Oh, they're playing with a massive Felbat and a Trickster. And a Juggler. Yeah, Trickster buff landed on the best target on their board, of course. Of course. I'm gonna lose this. Let's just kill the six drop in the back, you know? Let's take some damage on the board, so I'm chilling. Oh, actually, I'm winning this. <laughs> I guess. Winning is also fine, I'll take that. I was an atheist until I realized Ben was a god gamer. Oh, bow before me. Merlock, yeah, I don't think I need this. I don't need poison. I'm, I'm too strong to sell for poison. Four gold? I think that's worth, actually. Queen is a good endgame unit. I'll take it now. I'm not gonna play Greasebot, I think. Take random gems? No. We have some module. 
I have to sell a splitter then, that's not worth it really. Yeah, I think I just have to keep rolling. Could also consider buying tokens and cycling those, of course. But... Where is the fun in that? Yeah, I'm still mainly rolling for this triple for a pair on this, pair on this. And this will be my end game. And Cookie, of course. I can't die, so I don't need to all in any of these turns. <laughs> Hello, future me. Hey, YouTube. You guys want to say something to, to your future self or to people that will watch this? Now is your chance. <sighs> yeah. That's it. That was your only chance. I will never have one again. Is he dead? He is. Exactly. So let's go. No, you could Uther the Menace, yeah. I just still don't want to freeze, really. Freezing the nice myself all the options. Okay, here probably now is kind of throwing. Is it though? Maybe it's not. Okay. Mm. Also a good card, but I can't skill it in time. Okay. This gives me four gems a turn. I could suck the gems of these now, sell them, and just play double Dark Ace Elder, double Agam. I like that. It's a super interesting pivot. Okay, do I need to go to Cholga? I'm gonna go for full stats here. Fuck it. <laughs> Dude, this is such a fun board. I love it so much. Uh, so yeah, we don't have uh, gems anymore that we get with Agam. Uh, with uh, Gem Splitter. But again, that's only four. It's a pair I would have to keep. It doesn't scale a whole lot. And um, it can get sniped. But now I'm just playing double Dark Gaze Elder, double Agam. Every five gold, I put two gems on each, I get plus four, plus four on everything, right? Plus the gems. I can't AFK and win, I need to spend my money to win. That's how um, how these cards work. To thank more people, thank for what? Dude, I love this. I'm so happy with this game. You you can't tell, but I've not been able to play a beautiful Menagerie uh, combo game in a while. At least does feel good. To be fair, I did high roll my, my power level turns though. So if I did not power, uh, uh, high roll those turns, maybe at least felt worse. But it just felt so clean, the way that it leveled and stuff. That's a triple, I guess I'll take it, even though it's technically not super good. No, it's actually fine. Because it's the same as... Yeah, uh, it's the same. Let's just find another one forehead. I should definitely buy tokens now, huh? Yeah, I don't know if I want this smoker. Maybe. All the cycle shit. A cookie would still be good. I could play this as a reset for the Deflecto. Or I could just play Manted Queen and sell this next turn. I think is better. Oh wait, Shadok is actually surviving. Yeah, they're on tier 5? Forcing Murloc. So yeah, his plan was just hit Brand, stay on 4 and just force Murlocs, I guess. 6 gold. I've pressed this up until 5. That's how good this ear power was. Opens with Leroy. Didn't get taunt or- Fuck! That's the best possible hit that he can get. How are people this lucky? I do not understand. And again, the best shield. You got the best hit into the best shield. And his trickster lands on the best target. And even though all of that happened, he still lost. Even with all that luck, he still died here. That's insane. Am I that strong? Or, yeah, I don't die. I don't know, man.
I still haven't seen a cookie, sadly. I can feel it coming home soon. I could end on Demon Taunt, but hey. Well, I'm not a Mantis Queen, because why not? Uh, <laughs> I can also always Necro still. Yeah, I even complain when I win. That's how the, the god gamers do it. Yeah, I could suck gems. But I could just use Necro on this for more stats. Um, nah, I triple this card, right? I always triple that card. For sure. I don't think I've lost a single game yet since I hit Agam. Or single fights. I'm on six game win streak. They still, oh, they just leveled, but they didn't triple into a six, so I don't have to expect Mented Queen here. The only thing I can expect is a Leroy. I'm gonna keep this positioning, see what happens. Maybe put this in the back. Maybe I hear power. You know what? I think I hear power next turn. It's six gold for a single card, but if I triple, I'm gonna kill the Finley. I'm gonna kill the Shadowhawk. Shadowhawk top three is good, though. They played this well, because again, they played pretty much without hear power. They just went with Seth and Poison, I guess, which is respectable. It could actually beat me. <laughs> he bumps a shield here, which happened. Um, nah, my things are too big. We win, but we don't kill them. Unless they had left side. Okay, never mind. Damn, they actually got kind of close. It's just the power of Poison. That's your power. I do miss some buffs now, but you know what, what can I say? Still no cookie, do I necro now? I don't I actually think I, I don't think I want a necro. I want these to be big because if they are small, then I'm too all in on a couple of units I lose harder to poison or Leroy. So I'll only do it if I do hit the, the cookie. Yeah, what do I play? I guess a reset. Oh, I'm so happy with this board. And if you like the board as well, don't forget to subscribe to your channel if you're new here. Good plug. I think the pivot from uh, gem splitters, selling gem splitters and going into the Dark Ace Elders was properly timed. Because sometimes I hold into the splitters for way too long. And if you don't triple it, it's always awkward. Want to be the first to use 7 gold here, Power? I think I'm the first one to ever use 6 gold. Who uses 6 gold to get a single unit, man? Okay, they also have 2 Divine Shield Manted Queens. They led with Leroy. And they have a demon that's bigger than my entire board. This seems losable. And I didn't get a reset. He actually sniped it. And he gets a shield back. Dude, what the hell is happening? Yo, chill. Chill. Don't get shield. I actually shield on Queen is fine because I bump it. Um, okay, I win still. I don't know what I was talking about. <laughs> this was fun. This this was fun. It's a turn 14. It's not an incredibly long lobby. It's, it's about normal, I think. 